hey Brian, I'm going to take you through a couple things on the sousaphones that you may not in, uh, have encountered yet. Uh, like I said last night, it's pretty much like tearing down a big trumpet, but I do want to discuss with you how to take care of stuck top and bottom caps and how to take care of stuck slides if there are any. We'll start with valve caps. See the second, the second cap right here is frozen up. So what we're going to do is use my rawhide mallet and I'm going to gently tap around as much of the cap as I can and that will free it up for you. And so then from there take the valves out and put the valve stem, the plastic valve guide, and the metal washer which is sorry I only only have one hand with holding my phone which is right under there put all of those in one of the film canisters finger button and the top cap and the piston can all go in the cleaning solution then from here we'll go ahead and take the slides out so this slide is free but say you've got one of these larger slides that's stuck what I want you to do is use a gentle rocking motion don't crank on it very hard all you need to do is a gentle twisting motion while you pull I can't use both hands right now but you can steady the horn with one hand and then just rock and pull with the other you may have to get after it a little bit but if you're if you feel like you're doing it too hard then stop set it aside and I will take care of it whenever I come by today We'll go ahead and pull these out. The pads for these. I didn't take care of those first. I'm just taking this apart quickly to show you and I'm going to put it back together and let you tear it down so you can tear as many down as you can. Um, the pads, take those off as you're taking them out of the cases and leave them sitting in the case that they came out of. So now we've got these little slide crooks that if those are stuck, then what we do is I've got this lamp wick and I'm gonna leave it on your bench, but we'll wrap it through once and then we'll wrap it through again. This puts a loop that will catch the slide once we pull it out. And when you're pulling on these, try not to try to wrap it around nubs instead of going on top of them. But this will get it out where you can get some more leverage on it. You can wrap your hand around it and pull. This just makes it easier to use more leverage. Then you have one second valve slide. And see here, this third valve slide is stuck. So I'm going to use my lamp wick. Wrap it through once. Wrap it through twice and then pull that one stick that slide for you and then be careful with the valve springs just roll the sousaphone over and hold your hand on the casings to catch the three valve springs that come out and then onto bottom caps. <laughs> I apologize for the shaky video. This is really difficult. It's really early in the morning. I've been up since 2.30 this morning. So, uh, but bottom caps are going to tend to be stuck more than the top caps. So there's one that's free. But most of these we're going to have to tap on them. So we'll just go around real gently. and that loosens them up for you. I'm gonna put this back together for you and we'll call it good. What to do with the bell is I want you to check for a serial number in this location. It will just be the last three digits of the serial number which should correspond to the serial number on the second valve casing. In this case, we're good. If the bell is mismatched, we'll take care of that later. We just want to make sure that each bell has some sort of a serial number on it. And then when you take the bells out, I want you to line them up back here along the violin shelves 
And so you put one bell down like that and then put one alternating with the flare out this direction, flip them so you can scoot them as close together as possible. If you need to move some of this wood or my uh, tool, tool chest there, go ahead and do it. I think that's all I've got for you in this video. Thanks for working today. Bye.